Well, hello, Libra. Beautiful rising. Good afternoon and or lovely evening to you wherever you are, depending on the location of your rotation. <clears throat> Thank you for stopping by my channel. This is your weekly energy check-in, and this is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Jupiter signs. So, welcome, or welcome back, Libra, to another of your readings. I hope you are all doing so very well. Okay, so we got your tarot card out there for the week. Let's continue to pull your cards. So Libra, all of all of my readings are intended to be timeless, meaning whenever you have found this video is when you are meant to hear this message. So use your intuition to tune into what that message is for you. All right, Libra. Okay, and there we go. Okay, let's get your affirmations, and then we will start your reading. So I have shuffled and cut all the decks before starting the video. So don't worry. There. Okay. Let's go right there. Okay. So yeah, let's do this. Okay, Libra. Okay. So Libra, your tarot card of the week is the Six of Swords. The Six of Swords. So, like, it feels like, or it looks like, you are just being carried out of a difficult situation. So, you are being carried up and over and through into a safer place. So, yeah. And so whatever it, however it applies to you and in whatever situation, just know that, yeah, there are easier times ahead. And I know that, like, in this card, it looks like, uh, like they're, you know, maybe like pulling her arms, but I feel that this is a very strong person and that these are very strong beings that are helping her to get across this, you know, these swords here, you know, and swords are mental energy. So whatever it is that you find yourself, you know, thinking a lot about or, you know, tossing around in your mind a lot, just know that when, as you are moving through it, that it is for your highest good. You will be helped moving through it by some beautiful higher beings that are in resonance with you. Like you see how these birds are black and this person as well, like she is as well, the same tone. So... It's like they are of the same vibration. So I love it. I love it. Yeah, that's the first time I ever got that for that card. I love it. So in your recent past, Libra, you have the card of Beyond the Ordinary. Beyond the Ordinary. So I feel that in your recent past, you have realized that you are beyond the 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 ordinary. You are not like everyone else. None of us are like anyone else. Each of us are our own unique footprint, our own unique, you know, fingerprint, our own unique spirit, our own unique mark here on earth. And in your recent past, you have realized that and started to see that within yourself and started to see what it is or who it is that you want to be in this world. So that's beautiful. 
Your affirmation is from the secondary chakras, palms of the hands, number 108. I allow myself to grasp the world. I allow myself to grasp the world. So, yeah, as you realized in your recent past that you are beyond the ordinary, you have allowed yourself to grasp the world. And uh, ah, I feel like it's like a letting go of resistance. And... Uh, yeah, like just letting go of resistance. And even though it says, I allow myself to grasp the world, like sometimes we have to let go of one thing to grasp onto another thing, right? So that's what I'm feeling is that, yeah, when you accept yourself, accepted yourself as being beyond the ordinary, you grasp onto a new possibility and a new world. Wow, that's amazing. In your present energy, you have a tall tale, a tall tale. Right now, you are letting go of any tall tales you are or have been telling yourself in the recent past or in the present time letting go of them, you're seeing them, you're seeing them more clearly, they are being presented to you, and you are shining a light on them, shining a light on them, because it feels like these are tall tales that have been long hidden under the hat, long hidden, that you are now, it feels like you are now strong enough to take a look at strong enough to face and release so that's what that feels like wow and your affirmation is from secondary chakras knees number 118 because of my curiosity I learn easily and quickly because of my curiosity I learn easily and quickly yes so Right now, you are to a place where you have learned so much about just healing and growth and expansion and your own ascension, your own growth, and the things that you should do within your life. And so, um, these tall tales, they... Like they're, they just don't stand a chance. Whatever tall tales they are, they they don't stand a chance because you are now to the point where you can face them with all of the information that you have learned, all of this new knowledge that you have, this new information that you are now st stepping forward with, and you are ready to apply that knowledge to these tall tales right now that you have been maybe hiding from <laughs> for a long time and yeah it feels very powerful and yeah it feels amazing and wow in your future energy, Libra, you have seeing beyond, seeing beyond. So you are stepping into an energy of seeing beyond. And what's so funny is that you started with the word beyond and you're ending with the word beyond. So it's like the word beyond is book ending your reading and yeah beyond is such an expansive word it feels like I feel that you will be going beyond anything you expected yourself to be going or seeing or yeah like it's endless <laughs> it feels it feels endless it feels just so big and expansive so 
yeah, in your future energy, you are seeing beyond and you are just allowing yourself to expand. You are allowing yourself to not have any limits to where you feel you can go. Like you have healthy boundaries, but you have no limits to where you, you know, will allow your knowledge to expand to. That's beautiful. So you also have secondary chakras, soles of the feet, number 124. Let's see if we can get it to focus. There we go. Securely and easily, I advance on my path in life. Securely and easily, I advance on my path in life. So, yeah. Oh, wow. That's beautiful energy. Like, I, I just had to give it a second. So, we have the palms of the hands and the soles of the feet, of course. So, like, beyond, beyond. And then... You are securely and easily advancing on your path in life, and you are learning easily and quickly because of your curiosity. So, and you are allowing yourself to grasp the world. All of these in combination is just this big, it feels like a higher version of you Libra like you are stepping into a like you're stepping through a portal into a new version of yourself and this version of you is beyond the ordinary and seeing beyond and just expansive going beyond all of the above and yeah it's amazing super amazing so yeah so trust these energies that are vibrating at your same resonance and they will help you to move forward and get past through maybe all these are the tall tales that you need to get over at this time so trust your you know your guides you know, trust your guides, your angels, your source, your higher power, whatever it is. So, ah, Libra, thank you so much for letting me do this reading for you. <laughs> I love it. So if you found something that you resonate with, then please remember to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you're not already. I love you so very much, Libra. I will see you in your next one.